those things will kill you, right? <laughs> right. So you never really told us how you became this way. You came what way? You know. A zombie. I mean, come on, you didn't cut open your stomach rollerblading and scrape marks on Bicycle Falls heel, and I've never met anyone whose leg stays broken for that long, and with your crooked shoulders... You know I have back problems, alright? I'm poking your brain right now! Alright. Alright. Yes. Yes, I am a zombie. Alright. It's okay. We're still your friends. You just owe it to us to tell us how you... how this all happened. It all started in my younger years. I made some really bad decisions. Went to the doctor next week, blood was already coagulated. Full-blown zombie. That's rough, bro. Yep. But I mean, we all got regrets in our life. You just can't spend your time living in the past, man. Yeah, man. I mean, especially since you're not living in the present, either. <sighs> you're a real jerk. That's why I was in the back with the laundry, Kevin. Yeah, why do you always do your laundry on Saturdays anyways, Rob? I mean, I've been to your apartment, you have a washer and a dryer there. Hey, that's my business, all right? Wait, we've got a two-hour slot at the driving range, and you're gonna do laundry? Hey, I gotta do what I gotta do, all right? Sue yourself, all right. Um, excuse me. Um, I'm sorry. For what? Well, I guess at first I was really sorry about picking up Rendor, but now I guess I'm more sorry that our first conversation kind of revolved around underwear and guilt. Hold up. I've never had a conversation about babies and guilt before in someone's name, so let's change that. I'm Sydney. Oh, hi, I'm Rob. Uh, so I guess the, uh, the real question now is, uh, are you some kind of stalker or something? Because as far as I know, I've, I've seen you around, so I don't know you're not just some creepy guy when you touch my delicate. <laughs> uh, uh, someone once told me the way to truly know someone is to look in their eyes. I guess. He's a kind of sunken in one shot. Oh, okay, well, that's not what I was hoping for, so um, I guess I'm just going to go now. Uh, wait, no. I'll take it as your nice guy and you should call me. Sorry about the mess. Our tofu chicken is excellent, by the way. Thank you. Uh, so, what do you do there? Um, it's kind of an acquired taste. Hi, what is it? Can I you try some? Pre Sydney, there's something I gotta tell you. What is that? Alright. This isn't easy on me. Do you remember when you said I wasn't like the other guys? That I was different? Yeah, well, you're right, because, all right, technically, I'm not human. Well, at least not anymore. I'm a zombie. What? What is it? Is this a joke? I mean, do you, do you think it's funny to just open me up and then just... No, I wouldn't do that to you. I'm serious. I really am a zombie. Look at my crooked shoulders. You told me you had scoliosis. Come on, the gaping wound in the back of my head. What? Did you did you feed me human or whatever it is you zombies eat? No, it's it's tofu-man. I got it from the Whole Foods in Raccoon City. So, you're Rob, the zombie. That's that's perfect. That's just that's what, great. What are you? Oh. You gotta be kidding me. I open it up and this is what happens? 
No, you're not the guy I thought you were. You're dead. I mean, God, call me shallow, but I like for my boyfriends to have a pulse. If I did have a heartbeat, it'd beat for you. I don't know, he's just so honest. You know, he's a really sweet guy. He's dead. That should be the end of this conversation. He's no longer alive. Well, I'm thinking way worse than you. What about that really big pothead? He's pretty much dead. He smoked pot to enhance his life. It just so happened that the side effects were laziness and lack of personality. Well, okay, what about that really big gothic guy? Would I rather be the guy who's alive and wishes he were dead, or a guy who's dead and wants to be alive? Do you want, Sydney? The plus side is you won't have to worry about Halloween. He'll be the life of the party. Chubbs, leave me alone. Oh, uh, Chubbs, I told you to get out of the kitchen. Look what you made me do. I got sauce everywhere. Look at the mess you made. I'm going to be cleaning all day and I have to get this cleaned immediately. You're eating flesh? No, no, this isn't what it looks like. Sydney, come back. Zombie! Get him! <laughs> you know what this means, right? It's gonna be a lot harder after this. I think we can manage. I'm swimming in my wash tub with my friend, then I turn into a time machine. We teleported to the future and we saw us when we were 18. Oh no, what have we become? We just smoke and never sleep. Calling out my 